actually. My problem's not medical. It's kind of weird how... At first, when I got this DJI camera, which is what we're using right now, is Osmo 4. I would love to get the the new... They came out with one that's uh, Action Pro. It's like almost... It's like 600 bucks or something. Ridiculous. 650. It looks awesome in all means, but... I was using the GoPro a little bit the other day. Just because it is more reliable when I push when it's powered off and I push the record button, it fucking comes on and it records every single fucking time. And I don't miss what I'm trying to capture at the last second. I'm like, oh, I'm fucking trying to catch something. And I hit the button on the Osmo, I'm supposed to do the same thing. I hit it. There's a huge long pause, which it used to be faster than the GoPro. I'm gonna have to time it again because I used to be like, man, this thing comes on like right now, and now and lately it's been shitty. I've done an update, and of course, every time you update something, it makes it worse. My computer's been that way. I think I might have resolved the issue. Like, I've had crashes on a regular basis ever since I've had that computer and it's kind of pissing me off. I'm like, really like five grand for a computer <clears throat> and I'm not doing any intensive editing by any means. I'm editing 1080 footage, 24 frames a second. It's not like most people would be like 4K, which is <laughs> way more, with way more frames and all that Guga. And yeah, and the first time I phoned Apple support, I was finally fed up. I'm like, all right, I'm fucking phoning somebody because I got to tell somebody how I feel. But then I didn't have two terabytes of space on an external where I could back everything up. So I never got to do what they were. They were like, okay, well, let's try to put a clean reinstall fresh iOS, right? But I had to do a complete backup, which my computer is two terabytes. I don't need two terabytes. Excuse me, this is my life. And, uh, so I never did it. And I've been getting it, like, constantly. I, like, start uploading footage and crash. And as soon as it crashes while well, it's uploading footage, it messes all, like, it corrupts the whole upload from the camera, and I have to start all over again. So, when it takes, like, 40 minutes to upload my, my main camera, so let's say this camera, I have probably, like, you know, three hours of footage. It takes, like, 30, 40 minutes to upload that, and when I'm getting home at 8, 9 o'clock at night, and it's fucking jerking me off because it won't upload. It pisses me off. I get so mad. I'm like, God damn, I just need to get this uploaded so I can clear the SD card and go to sleep. Because I know, obviously, other ways I can put it on an external. And lots of times, when it crashes, I just end up putting it to a file on the screen, on desktop. Because I'm just like, okay, I'm not fucking around. And when it crashes while uploading, this is the only answer because for some reason it seems to think that it has a carbon copy and it just puts it in there to the editor, but as soon as I unplug the camera, everything goes red. But anyways, I think I resolved it because I had like dual screen issues giving me problems too and it was only a refresh rate at 60 hertz, which is not high by any means. So showering me with rocks just because he had to come be beside me. Fuck. Some people are just fucking retarded, I tell you. Thanks for coming over. You had to fucking speed up, get right beside me and shower me with rocks. This red deer all of a sudden has decided to uh, sand with like gravel. I'm like, what up? The other day a sanding truck passed me on the TOA going the opposite way and it just completely showered me with rocks. I was like, well that's fucking asshole, eh? 
Yes. Like, why would you do that? And it was right at rush hour when everybody's going to work. It's like minus 20 right now. Uh, 23 says the car, so probably with the slight taste of wind, it's probably, you know, 30. But anyways, we're gonna go out to Drayton Valley. We got a jockey. I gotta take out a load of mats from here. And then we're going out to the fiddle. Um, just gonna jockey some mats and tanks today. <sighs> Nothing too glorious, but it'll look cool still. Try to get some proper footage, you know what I mean? We'll uh, throw the camera around, try to get some different views and all that good stuff and uh, make it look cool. I dropped my camera walking in the shop this morning because it wasn't clipped on my bag. I now have damage on all cameras. Sweet, brah. Wrecking shit already. I didn't wreck anything. made in Canada. Alright, let's truck.
How often Prime needs to drain the lizard nowadays?
started doing crack. Fuck, these are so good. Honey roasted. Look at that. It's even smart eating. Huh. Well, I don't know what that means, but I guess I'm getting smarter. Peanut free may contain other tree nuts. What other tree nuts? These nuts. I'm allergic to walnuts. You'll be all right though. Fucking Viper glasses, what are you, Macho Man Ready Savage?
settle down. It's kind of pointless. Kind of need to start it right now. Hello. It's got to be some more batteries. Uh, I hate it. I've never used one of these. Mm. Somewhere there's a battery box. Let's take a yonder. Oh look, battery box. <laughs> All right, I'm probably turning that off. This ain't so hard. No wonder try or uh Downs loves doing this. This is gravy. Oh yeah, my clutch brake just uh, shit the bed. My last load there. Super awesome. As long as the starter doesn't fail, we'll be all right. Hopefully my wheel is in the right spot. About to find out. Technically certified now. I didn't even have to idle it up. Oh no, how do you turn it off now? Shit. That was easy. I think that would not be the way, but I guess it is. I should slide the wheel. This will save me some time, but could just take off the mud flaps. Mm, we're gonna be fighting some hills. Yeah, let's just take the mud flaps off. We're gonna go out to Sun Pine. I think tomorrow by 2 p.m. So, yeah, it sucks, but we get to take the gravy way out because I'll be bobbed out. So we get to come out the North Fork. Uh, you don't know want I me? Mean? No, probably not. Some of you will. Some of you will not. Ouch. I have underlying issues, don't judge me. Judge me, judge me, judge me. Oh, I have a few issues I need to get to. Oh, that's not gonna pass. It is leaking. Yep, that's right. That's not as much.
much better. Oh. <laughs> Got a few things on the list. I think these are spring. Oh no, it's air, right? You didn't dump the air. Huh, you'd think you would normally dump it, but. <sighs> what are these? These are oversizing. I don't think they're 12 wide. Sorry, 11? We need beacons after 11, but I guess I'm about to find that out too. Looks like it just got dropped off, so should be a win-win for me. Shouldn't be any frozen brakes is what I mean, but only time will tell. That should be fine. The only thing I've really hauled other than uh, coils here is their, uh, hmm, I think they're sand belts when I worked at Hudson's. Should have lots of room there. Should wait on the drives for when I'm climbing some hills, you know what I mean? We're gonna go down some sick logging roads. Minus 15 right now here, so it's not too cold. It's, it's not too bad when the sun is out. But once that sun disappears, that hub's good. That feels a little low. I'd say those nuts are good. D's nuts. Got <laughs> Fuck the plow of snow a little bit around here. Hmm. Hub meter, yeah, that one's good. <sighs> that one's good. Nuts are looking good. That must be where you dump the air. Oh, it's seized in there pretty good. <laughs> Holy fuck. Thank you.